to uh, welcome back to my video today I am going to show you how to host your Java web application in your office or home network or any network you need maybe your college or any other client network anywhere you go you are where you want to host your a Java web project okay now for example I am just showing a simple network diagram for you okay this is how uh, a network diagram will be so in this network diagram I have shown uh, three PCs here PC1 PC2 and PC3 uh, and in the now here an internet line is coming from outside uh, from your internet service provider and it will be connecting uh, directly to a device called uh, a network switch or network router so once uh, the internet is coming to there this network router will split the internet to the pieces uh, which we, we you will you have uh, in all your all your network so this will form a network now like uh, three pieces and one a network switch and the internet is coming to the network switch and the network switch splits the internet to uh, three pieces so whatever the count of pieces no problem this is how a normal network uh, diagram or normal network of any any uh, home or any office network or any client pc client network or uh, your college or network school network this is how it works like uh, the network switch will switch uh, network switch will split the internet to all of the client pcs okay talking about uh, the ip address which i have mentioned here now uh, the public ip is the ip which your internet service provider will be pointing to your uh, router which will be splitting to uh, the network network pcs now this public ip is the ip address which you will get from uh, get my ip if you search in google this is the this will be the ip which your service provider will be giving to you so uh, if you try this get my ip from any of these pcs like pc1 pc2 and pc3 you will be getting this as the your ip address in there but actually your network gateway is having net, network gateway is nothing but your network switch the network switch is having uh, holding that ip and this ip is getting split to a network internal IP uh, like this 192.168.100.7 so this 100.789 will be in the series of your gateway IP local gateway IP like here the local gateway IP is 192.168.100.1 uh, I'm uh, saying again now this public IP will reach here and uh, uh, will reach your gateway and this gateway uh, will be holding an IP in some series so I it here for my case it starts from 192 160 100.1 so after that like 100.2 will be this this network uh, switch will ascend uh, from 2 and go on to 25 like the limit of your uh, gateway for example here it's uh, started from 7 8 nine I am showing you uh, the case of my my PC I'm just uh, if you want to check uh, your IP address details and gateway details just go right click you on uh, internet uh, icon and just uh, open network and sharing center just click on the connections so in the details you can see what is your IP my IP is 192.168.100.7 and my uh, default gateway IP is 192.168.100.1 this is what I shown here 192.168.100.7 and uh, 192.168.100.1 and my public IP is this one seen from same PC if I search public IP this is my IP address so hope you got uh, the details of this network now uh, I'm going to host my Java application in pc1 that is this pc holding uh, this ip address and i'm going to show how i'm uh, hosting in this pc1 and i'll show uh, using uh, this ip this network i'll use that uh, java web application i can use that uh, java web application 
PC2 and PC3. So uh, for in this case, the PC1 is the server and PC2 and PC3 is the client PCs. Okay, so PC1 is uh, I am holding now this PC which I am showing is a PC1 uh, which will act as server and PC2 and PC3 is a client PC which can uh, which if I uh, host in PC1 they can use that web application. All the uh, databases and server uh, the servers will be in this PC that is this PC should be on always and uh, these two pc can use that hope you got uh, about uh, the network structure of normal network structure how it will be now uh, for deploying your java web application in your server you need uh, to install apache tomcat i'm showing in apache tomcat whatever server server uh, you are using server softwares you are using you can use it for here i am using apache tomcat 8 you can uh, download it free of course from internet so open source so i am just installing now in my server pc uh, carry on with the installation it's a normal process just go on So I have just uh, installed Apache Tomcat. Now just click finish. Don't want to run this. Just click finish. Now here, okay, that's installed. So I'm searching Apache. Tomcat eight. Okay, I'm getting configured Tom. Started the my Tomcat server in my PC, which I'm going to use as the server. Now, let me open the login admin login for my Tomcat. So it's a local host colon eight zero eight zero. So this is how uh, you uh, you manage your uh, Google. I mean, sorry, uh, manage your Java web application. I'll uh, show you how to host this now. I'm just showing you a uh, web project it's a sample web project I'm, I'm just showing you how to do this I'm just creating a uh, sample web project I'm just creating a low start I'm just writing something and let me run this from here okay so this project is assembled but nothing is there i'm not uh, not connecting to database anywhere i'm not connecting to anything just a index page with uh, a, a sentence like hello start now i want to hold this in my network i'll show you how now just export this uh, project as war file so I'm just uh, putting it as host example and I'm uh, exporting it to my desktop let's see okay I have my uh, war file here now what you want to do is just go to your admin panel you can see here select war file to upload just click that and just select your war file and click deploy that's all so you can see here your application is deployed so your application link will be local host the uh, port number which is default and uh, host example here it is your uh, application is live now okay so you can see uh, here local host so as I told this is your server PC so if you want to access your uh, project from other PCs in your in your network 
so this is my PC number 2 you can see uh, my IP address here I'll show uh, it's 192.168.100.8 okay now first thing what I'm doing is I'm trying to get connectivity to uh, the server it's a uh, 192.168.100.7 So if I'm trying this, I am getting the replay from them and it's a zero percentage loss. So this is how I check connectivity to the server. So what you want to do next is open the you open your uh, browser. This is my uh, Internet Explorer. I'm just uh, taking the IP address 192.168.100.7 which is my server IP and just the link the same link uh, which uh, I hosted the okay you have to use HTTP so you can see uh, the application is here so you can use this anywhere you want so in any network uh, any PC in the same network you can just type uh, this link and this uh, port number and this application name you can use it uh, so this is how you can host uh, your web application in uh, your home or uh, office network so hope you got this if you have any doubt in this uh, please let me know I'll be happy to help you and please subscribe for my videos and like my video thank you